I stopped sharing with my parents while my brother lives here. My brother, 32, and his wife, 32, have been together since high school and now have four kids, the oldest being 13. His wife stays home, and he works in cleaning at a fly-in, fly-out camp. The job pays well, but they spend a lot on things like gaming systems and new iPhones for their two oldest kids. I'm 28 and live in the loft above my parents' garage. I don't pay rent because my parents want me to save for my future. I help around the house and buy groceries for them and myself. My brother and his family live in the basement in law suite, which was originally meant to be a rental to help my parents save for retirement. After my brother lost his job due to not getting vaccinated, my parents let them move in. I used to enjoy buying gifts for my parents, but my brother's family always seemed to need whatever I gave. For instance, I brought my mom a beautiful, vibrant bag from Colombia, but my nine-year-old niece took it to school and lost it. I got my dad a special bottle of bourbon he enjoys, only to find that my brother and his wife drank it mixed with juice because it tasted too strong. Now, I focus on experiences with my parents. I took my mom to see Anastasia with great seats, and I treated my dad to a steak dinner and an upscale cocktail afterward. These are things they love but would never spend money on themselves. I keep the groceries I buy in my loft, sometimes cooking meals for my parents or bringing ingredients to cook with my dad. My brother began asking why I don't leave the groceries in shared spaces or why I stopped buying physical gifts for our parents. He claimed I should contribute more since I live rent-free. I asked him what he contributes, and he said he's too tired on his week's home, and his family is too busy to help. I work full-time, volunteer at a cat rescue, do theater sports as a hobby, and help with yard work, errands, and taking care of my grandmother, who lives in a dementia care facility. I pointed this out, and he called me unreasonable. I replied that I don't leave anything lying around for him or his family to borrow without permission. Now, there's tension, and my parents are upset. His wife called me selfish for not sharing the treats I buy for my parents. I can afford to treat my parents and myself, but not to support five extra people who don't contribute.